All right, so this is going to be our boxes for Hunter's Chorus in book three. Okay. So our very first box is the first measure with the pickup and then downbeat of the second measure. Okay. So it's just this. Right. So just that much right there. Okay. Um, make sure that we're really short on the first note, right? And that we're starting a little bit past the balance point so that we can start this note on the balance point. Right. So one more time. Okay. Um, and make sure that we're really smooth on that slur. And that we're really rhythmic with our left hand. Da 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 da. Right? Okay. So that's our first box. Our second box is going to be measure five, six, seven. Okay. And it's measure seven with the downbeat of measure eight. Okay. Um, so it starts up bow. So it's slur, separate. And we have dots on those, so make sure they're really short. Da da, short, short, da. Okay. Um, we're going to want to start at the kind of the tip of our bow. And come all the way back. Balance point. And then to the tip. So one more time. Okay. Um, and then once you've done that, I want you to try expanding it to add the measure before. Okay. So you're going to go down bow. So you can practice shifting up to that, right? Um, so the first few days just do in place already. And then once you've done that for a few days and you're comfortable, then add the measure before, so measure six and full bow to add practicing that shift. Um, next, measure three happens a couple times, or not measure three, box three happens a couple times. So it's going to be 13, 14, measure 15. So it's just going to be measure 15 plus the downbeat. Um, well, I guess not measure 15. The second half, so the second beat of measure 15 and the first beat of measure 16. Okay, so it's just these. That's all of measure 15, or that's all box three, okay? Okay, and that thing repeats um, one line later in measure, let's see, I think it's 19. Yeah, 19. All right? Okay, so just that is box three, both times it happens. So in measure 15, 16, and in measure 19. Okay. Um, our next box is going to be measure 21 and 22 with the pickup, right? So it's, that's the whole box, okay? So this is kind of the same idea as the down berry, up berry stuff from book one. Da, 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 da. Just make sure that we're short and accented on these, on the eighth notes, and then so this would be going from the balance point to kind of the middle of the bow. Okay. So that's box four. Box five is going to be measures 25 and 26. Just right. So make sure we're right because we have a dot on the eighth note. Okay. And make sure we're really rhythmic. Um, some people have a tendency to, right, because it's, they're just thinking it's got to be super fast, so, okay, just make sure we have space between those. That box repeats in measures 29 and 30, exactly, okay, so both those spots are, are box five. Box six is going to be bo or measure 31, okay, just that measure, so it's going to be start at the balance point, get out to the middle. And then, right, that happens twice. So box six is 30 and 30. Wait, hold on. No, 31 and 32. Just make sure that you're putting the accents where they're supposed to be, right? So on the B and C and D, right? Bum, ba -da -ba, bum, ba -da -ba. Um, so those are the boxes for Hunter's Chorus. Um, big things to focus on, just make sure we're always doing the right articulation, right? So if it has a dot, make sure it's really short and that there's space. Um, and 
make sure that you stay rhythmic because you got a lot of slurs with 16th notes. So make sure those stay really rhythmic with the left hand, right? Um, yeah, and I think that'll do it. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out, okay?